Because uh, unfortunately, because of the male dominance and the and the sort of power, the the, the power um, transmutation, you could say, of, of most men. I'm just going to, as a generalisation, I don't know if this is um, similar to the path you've been on, but it's very dysfunctional and quite, you know, male dominated <laughs> in terms of uh, of of controlling everything really mm. controlling mm. women controlling mm. nations controlling mm. society controlling mm. business you know yeah. do you know what i mean so for yeah, me yeah, the divine masculine is more of somebody who's sort of letting go of that need to control constantly mm. but then through letting go of needing to control there becomes this more authentic control yeah but with it is that it, uh, men and masculinity it is course connected but in women i find there's a masculine force in men there's a feminine like the young idea of the anima animus you know that we have both but we identify with one i met m m women that are more masculine than yeah. most yes, friends yeah. guys you know male yeah. friends i know so it's a force that's applied to men and women and on the planet i think the masculine whatever energy has been dominant for what two or three thousand years mm. through you know military force through mm. priesthoods through all of that mm. but before that there was some there was another there was the other side going on there was the, the, the feminine had ascendants you know for thousands of years mm. all these images of venuses mm. and caves but somewhere they didn't meet they kind mm. of crossed over mm. and i think hopefully now we're at a space where they're going to start to come together because the conversation should be how do men and women really meet how do we yeah. Uh, meet in ourselves right. these energies of these forces the I sacred think, I, marriage I think you're so right because I think there's that thing about okay how is that you, you would, in, I think in your talk you were talking about this thing okay starting from the individual so if I'm as an individual whoever I am whatever my experience let's say as a man and I'm feeling like I need to do this or I need to do that and you know how guys often we tend to hold rigid or like this do you know what I mean you see mm. it often walking down the street whether it's a guy who's very much a kind of a, somebody kind of the street kind of mentality or somebody a business mentality it's still very very serious this, this thing to be attention mm. uh, I, I, not all of those dimensions of, of them seem to be sit at, at peace so I think that when as an individual we can uh, can just explore okay well who who am I what sits with me how do I want to be do I do I feel as though I need to be this hard or this tough all the, all the mm. time or can I be just a little bit more like can I be a little bit more emotional I, I think there's also a, a myth that guys aren't very emotional yeah. um, one of my but, you know, best friends who's male. You know, he he, he makes he, make, he he makes the point that there is a lot of that that sensitivity side. But the, the pressure for for guys to feel as though they need to be somehow other, I, I think, isn't very helpful. And, and mm. therefore, that how that tension presents itself in one's relationship to, to oneself, in one's relationships with others, in those different roles that we have, is really, really kind of, is really kind of difficult. And you see it all the time how it plays itself out when, when we can just be more accepting. Okay, I have these different emotions. I have these different thoughts, these different feelings. In whatever way, it's just far more healthy and that helps every kind of relationship. Mm. Um, I just think that we, yeah, we've, we, we've, we've still got a long way to go, ironically, with, 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 with that. We have this old conditioning. I mean, you know, from years, women were nurturers looking out from the caves to you know modern days and men went out and hunted and, and now it's like men go out to work and women yeah women can enter the marketplace but still there's a whole equality thing mm. but mm.